2022 Ford Maverick. There's a new Ford pickup in town, positioned as a smaller, less expensive alternative to the Ranger and F-150. The big news is the Maverick's standard hybrid powertrain and impressive fuel economy, but prospective buyers will also be enticed by the compact pickup's respectable towing and payload capacities as well as its thoughtful convenience features. The Maverick's main competition will be the upcoming Hyundai Santa Cruz pickup. The Ford Maverick is a 2022 IntelliChoice Best Overall Value Award winner. Don't let the Maverick's low starting price fool you, this is a solid truck. Buyers looking for great fuel economy will gravitate toward the base hybrid powertrain, which provides more than enough power to motivate this small truck. In our first drive, we found the suspension absorbs small bumps in the road well, although larger road imperfections proved more of a challenge. AWD Mavericks have an independent rear suspension which improves ride quality. The upgraded turbo model has its merits. The engine and transmission work well together, we found out in our first test, and it's the better option for towing and off-roading. It also tested favorably against its main competitor, the 2022 Hyundai Santa Cruz, in our comparison test. Stepping inside the cabin, we appreciate the Maverick's helpful storage cubbies and stylish cabin that mix textures and geometric patterns in an eye-catching way. However, we found the seats uncomfortable on our test trucks, and there's not much legroom in the back row. Ford is bringing compact pickups back into the conversation. It's capable and rides comfortably, plus it won't cost you an arm and a leg. Ford is eager to point out the Maverick is the first pickup in America with a standard hybrid powertrain. The base truck will feature a hybrid setup, a 2.5-liter four-cylinder and electric motor that combine for an output of 191 horsepower and 155 pounds to foot of torque. Pairing it with a CVT automatic and front-wheel drive, Ford targeted 40 miles per gallon city and 500 miles of range, figures it actually exceeded with the Maverick's official EPA rating of 42 miles per gallon city, 33 miles per gallon highway. That makes it the most fuel-efficient pickup on sale. It's certainly not the quickest, though, in our testing 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration took 7.6 seconds. Although you can't get a hybrid AWD Maverick for 2022, we can safely assume that option is on the way. There's also the possibility for a future electric variant. That said, if you're in need of a bit more power and capability, Ford has you covered. The Maverick can also be ordered with a 2.0-liter turbo i4 kicking out 250 horsepower and 277 pounds to foot of torque, and that powertrain works with an 8-speed automatic for forward or available AWD. We tested an AWD FX4 model with this engine accelerating to 60 miles per hour in 7.0 seconds. Fuel economy is rated by the EPA as 23 thirtieths of a mile per gallon with forward, and 2229 with AWD. Ford is including the essentials of its Ford Copilot 360 safety features on every Maverick. Automatic emergency braking and automatic high beams are standard on all trims. Spend a little cash on higher trims, though, and you can score almost everything Ford has to offer. Stop and go adaptive cruise control, lane centering, blind spot monitoring, and rear cross-traffic alert are all available. While the Maverick's 4.5 footbed is smaller than those in a Ranger or F-150, Ford implements clever solutions to get the most out of the space. With slots stamped into the side of the bed, owners can install 2x4s or 2x6s to create segmented storage, elevated floors, and cargo racks. There are also two tie-downs, which double as bottle openers, 4D rings, and threaded holes built in. The bed features integrated 12-volt electrical outlets on either side of the bed, too, plus an available 110-volt house outlet. While the Maverick's 4.5-footbed is smaller than those in a Ranger or F-150, Ford implements clever solutions to get the most out of the space. With slots stamped into the side of the bed, owners can install 2x4s or 2x6s to create segmented storage, elevated floors, and cargo racks. There are also two tie-downs, which double as bottle openers, 4D rings, and threaded holes built in. The bed features integrated 12-volt electrical outlets on either side of the bed, too, plus an available 110-volt house outlet. Yes, it's small, but the Maverick still delivers utility. Even with a humbly powered hybrid powertrain, the Maverick has a 1,500-pound payload capacity and there's enough space in the bed for a standard ATV. Towing capacity for the hybrid is 2,000 pounds. 
but with the Turbo 4 and an optional 4K tow package, it'll tow 4,000 pounds. In our experience towing 3,000 pounds with such a truck, it felt plenty confident. That said, the upcoming Hyundai Santa Cruz compact pickup is more capable in both measures. Every Maverick including the base model features an 8.0-inch touchscreen infotainment system that includes Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility. There's also a standard Wi-Fi hotspot that can connect up to 10 devices. Ford has integrated some forward-thinking design touches that improve the usability of the Maverick's cabin. For example, the split armrests offer enough space to hold a 1-liter water bottle, your standard big ol' Nalgene, so it won't be rolling around on the floor. You'll also find a storage bin beneath the rear seats that will easily swallow sports equipment, tools, or camping gear. Despite tight dimensions, the cabin feels spacious. Ford says it's incorporating unique textures and materials throughout the cabin. The dash panel is said to have a stone-like finish, similar to the dash in the Tesla Cybertruck concept, and the cabin also includes ground carbon fiber. Rear seat passengers can take advantage of fit, Ford integrated tether, slots that, with an available accessory package, can hold cup holders, an additional storage bin, grocery hooks, and a cable organizer. Ford has even shared the CAD file so you can 3D print accessories yourself. More OEM accessories are sure to come, and we look forward to seeing what the aftermarket dreams up. The Maverick will be offered at three trim levels, all of which we've seen on other Ford vehicles. Stealing headlines, the base Maverick XL will start at just $21,490. That makes the Maverick the cheapest pickup on sale. The XLT and Lariat, which are both available with an FX4 off-road package, cost about $24,000 and $27,000, respectively. Spring for the Lariat-based Maverick first edition if you want unique graphics and exclusive colors. Our pick would probably be a Maverick XLT with the EcoBoost 4-cylinder, FX4 package, and AWD, but the base Ford truck is looking like a great feature per dollar value if you don't need the extra driven wheels.